Hey guys, Too Legit City here. Today we're going to be talking about the incubators and a simple automation setup to make it so that it does not consume that much power. If you guys didn't know about the incubators, this incubator building allows your egg to get a buff called the lullaby. And the lullaby buff, if you guys didn't know, persists through the incubator being powered off so this buff is applied when the incubator is on as you can see geek over here is hugging the egg and it's going to get a lullaby buff now immediately after we're going to see that the timer is going to go off soon you're going to see that the egg is going to maintain the increased incubation rate on the egg and this automation allows you to save power on the incubator as you can see, you saw exactly how it worked. The psycho sensor kicked onto a green signal. And now that it's off, we are not only not consuming power, you could see that we're only consuming 180 watts because the automation is turning off the incubator. The egg in and of itself is still getting the lullaby bonus, meaning that the incubation rate is going to happen faster. So for the most part, if you guys didn't know, the incubator building in and of itself does nothing to the egg other than allow your ranchers to sing lullaby to it and give it the buff. Otherwise, the building does not actually need to be on for you to benefit. However, you cannot lullaby to the egg if the incubator is off. So what we did was we set up a cycle sensor and you could set this up depending on your schedules for your ranchers depending on what time schedule your ranchers are you just have to line it up to, uh, to their work schedule and then afterwards the active duration is how long you want the period to be it works out for me around 10 percent 10 11 percent is where i need it to be and this duration is dependent on how far your dupes are going to have to travel to get to that area and you might have to play around with the duration but the idea is you're going to want your duplicates to be able to lullaby to it give it a little bit of time before you have it forcefully disabled and by doing so you save a lot of power because that 240 watts is being pulled constantly as long as the eggs inside so by having this automation set up it makes it so that you consume a lot less while having the buff applied but it's that simple adding a cycle sensor with a active duration around 10 to 15 percent the activation time period as you can see actually scales with the time period on the cycle you could try to figure it out with as this is kind of representative of the uh, full cycle of the cycle so if your duplicates are active in the first half you're going to want it somewhat in the first half if it's the second half you guys could do the second half now, in order for this to work well, you have to also set your incubator at max priority, meaning so that when it's enabled by your cycle sensor, your ranchers need to prioritize this building out of all the other ranching duties. So that means typically everything else you're going to want to set to a maximum of priority eight for the grooming, maybe something less for the shearing stations at seven. But of course, you want to make sure that there is nothing else at priority nine, because if they miss that window, they're going to miss lullabying the critter, which means that you effectively just wasted your power for a couple cycles or a couple seconds in the cycle for no reason whatsoever. But guys, that's been a quick tip about the incubator. Another bonus thing is that the incubator is actually the only building that increases the ranching attribute that is otherwise known as husbandry. So this is the only building every time they lullaby the eggs, they get a little bit of experience for this. Other than that, nothing else actually increases your husbandry as that's a uh, very interesting attribute. No other attribute really works like that where it only has one way to gain experience. But otherwise guys, that has been the incubators, how to run them a little bit more efficiently. Hope you guys enjoyed today's video. And of course guys, don't forget to like and subscribe. Thank you guys.